I'm going to keep my voice very, very low because we've just found a beautiful herd of elephants, but they're drinking. Now, they're different ages. There's some youngsters. I can see a few babies there. They are drinking at the moment, so I don't want to disturb them. And fortunately, we are downwind, so they haven't picked up that we are here yet. What a wonderful, wonderful sighting. There's beautiful light coming through now on them too. And um, they're just happily drinking at that pan. <laughs> oh, this is really, really great. I think, why don't we try another little angle, Fergus? Follow me. Now stay with us, we're just going to have a look around some trees. I think we'll have a lovely view from over here. Just through there, there we go, look at that. Wow, this is really wonderful, we have nice and close. They, um, they're probably about, about 40 or 50 meters away from us. So now with a herd of elephant, we do just have to be cautious. And that's why I'm keeping my voice very, very low. Very, very soft. I don't want to disturb them or alert them, but they seem very comfortable. What we just need to watch out for now is which direction they leave the water hole so that we don't get in their way. As I said, there's beautiful light now, the sun, sunrise, elephants drinking. This is really such a beautiful sighting. I love seeing elephants on foot. I mean, this is probably one of my favorite things. I see they're moving away from us in that direction, which is perfect. Again, just going to wait, let them move off slowly. See, they all stopped. Now, what they're doing is often one elephant, it's amazing how they communicate. One will stop, and the whole herd stops, and they're dead quiet, and they listen, and they smell. Is there any danger? And then they'll move on. So come have a look. They're moving on now. Here they go. Just moving away from us. That is really, really great. And quite a few different ages there. You could see some really young ones. Probably two years, two years old or so, um, judging by the size. Let's see, there they go. Maritza, they would definitely see us from from this distance um, if we were really out in the open. But we used we used some cover, we used some trees just to kind of. Um, hide a little bit from them and you can see luckily they, they couldn't see us so just a little bit of foliage and vegetation around her which was perfect for us it gave us a bit of cover that we could see them but we didn't stand out really so they didn't see us and also the wind was perfect the wind was blowing from them we were standing downwind of them so wind was blowing from them towards us so they wouldn't have smelt us the first thing you need to do is when you are on a walk is check the wind direction it's very very important so the wind was perfect and um, and they fortunately we didn't disturb them because that's the last thing you want you don't want to disturb an animal so they drank they finished and off they went so that was really great See,